My name is Joe Whitty. I'm the maintenance manager for Major Tool and Machine. Sylvester Williams, um, non-destructive technician. Kate Chernivsky, I am a production planner. My name is Michael Berthe, I'm a CAD CAM engineer here at Major Tool and Machine. Craig Bailey, maintenance technician. My name is Mike Daniels and I'm a machinist. My name is Sean Hoskins and I'm a machinist. My name is Alex Dunn, my job position is quality inspector. My name is Brandon Faulkner, my position is project engineer. So as a project engineer, my job is to take requirements from the customer when they're asking us for a quote and turn those into a quote. Uh, and then if we receive the work, uh, turn that information into a routing, processing how we get the material, how we route the material through the shop, machining, uh, turning, whatever it might be to process that and uh, then out the door. I have a Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering from Purdue University. What I really enjoy about manufacturing is seeing the parts come to life uh, from raw material to uh, actually hitting the machines, cutting chips, uh, seeing the parts take shape, uh, seeing the different processes, how it transforms the part uh, from just a, a raw hunk of metal into a finished part. Not just go to the technician, we check for wear, tear, and defects on the part without causing any damage to the part. United States Air Force was my background. Um, I had technical school in the military, um, six months uh, training of NDT, so on that side we learned X-ray, eddy current, penetrant, mag, and ultrasonics. Joy about manufacturing is a vast variety of parts that we work on. Um, being a kid, uh, going to the museum at NASA in Alabama, never thought that the day that I would come where I'd be able to work on an actual piece that goes into space. I really like working in a manufacturing environment. It is pretty fun. It's pretty fast paced, which I like. It's something different every day which for me makes my job really fun. Uh, there's a lot of day-to-day -day things that are the same, but there's a lot of things about it that can change from day-to-day. -day. A big part of my job is to track parts from their conception to their shipment out the door to our customers. CAD CAM engineer here at Major Tool takes the customer's model, prints, and the engineer's process we take it to our system, makes the model into code that the machine runs. So we go through the whole process. We take the tools, take all the prints and the tolerances and make it into a process that's gonna run on the CNC machines. So I started in high school uh, as a vocational student. My junior and senior year, done that for two years. Then I went on to Vincennes for two years and got a degree from there in their machine tool. Uh, I think it's tool and die is the degree I actually have. Learned a lot there and then went out into the workforce after two years. Craig Bailey, maintenance technician. Take care of everyday tasks to keep the new facility running, uh, primarily machine breakdowns, PMs, uh, but that can range anywhere from everyday tasks of facilities all the way to machine repair and or electrical. As a machinist, I'm responsible for the setup, sometimes programming, and machining of the part. Um, based on the complexity of the part, I'll either have a program package given to me or I'll do manual data in input, which is programming at the machine. So before working in Major Tool, I completed the CNC and manufacturing program at Lincoln Technical Institute. Uh, after that, I worked in a couple of small machine shops. And when I started working for Major Tool, they put me on the setup team. Uh, for about six months to familiarize myself with setup, rigging, lifting of large parts. Um, after that was complete, I went through the machinist training program and uh, about four or five months in the machinist training program, I was put on a large machine at Plant Honestly, the, my favorite thing to do, or my favorite thing about manufacturing is the fact that what I'm making is tangible. Um, I can see it at the end of every day, I can see the work that I put in, um, and then when you go and you turn on the news, you get to actually see what we make here at Major Tool and uh, that's very, very gratifying. I went two years to uh, Heinz Career Center for Machine Tool Technology. I also attended IV Tech and uh, have had lots of on-job training at Major. I would recommend uh, to get into your vocational programs, career centers. Uh, I also recommend if you have two-year technical degrees are a good place to go to uh, and just go out and look for a job in it. When I started in this trade, everybody said it was dying, but if anything, it's more than ever, and I suspect it will continue to grow, especially technically.
My name is Gabriel Velasquez and I'm a welder. Fabricate parts, uh, put pipe to parts together and I weld them um, for the blueprint specifications. Um, I TIG, MIG, uh, a lot of the stuff pretty much daily. I have experience in welding uh, stainless steel, uh, metal steel, uh, ink canal. For uh, major two, I graduated from uh, Bay Davis High School. Um, I learned welding in there in uh, Area 31 Career Center. I um, decided to take that as a career and um, went to Ivy Tech Community um, School and took welding classes uh, for two years in there. A quality inspector verifies in-process and final hardware for conformance to customer drawings and specifications. I started with CAD classes in high school and con continued on to study mechanical engineering technology in Ivy Tech Community College. Start looking into which classes you can take as early as possible. Look into CAD classes, welding classes, machining classes. Understanding the fundamentals of manufacturing is going to take you a very long way. And if you're interested in an engineering focus, be sure you have a firm understanding of those essentials moving forward. Uh, my outlook for the manufacturing industry is extremely strong. There's always going to be a need for making, manufacturing things, putting things together. I see the manufacturing jobs coming back to the U.S. I believe it's on the up. Um, I've been in the industry roughly about 15 years. Um, the last five years there's been a definite increase um, in manufacturing jobs. It definitely seems like in the United States uh, we are pushing forward to get more manufacturing jobs here instead of outsourcing them to other countries. My outlook for manufacturing in the United States is very good. The industry is on the rise and help is needed more than ever. I think that in the next 30 years we're going to see large leaps that we saw similar to in the 1960s to American space flight and defense applications. It's positive. I mean, uh, we have a lot of things happening right now in the economy and a lot of focus now is, is, is back on manufacturing and I think it's, it's positive, very positive. Possibly new people, good people, detail oriented people. Thank you and have a great manufacturing day. Thank you and have a great manufacturing day. Thank you and have a great manufacturing day.